Carol Lindley, a talented actress, brought life to the silver screen with her performances. She was known for her roles in films that left a lasting impression on audiences. Her journey in the film industry began with a breakthrough performance that earned her critical acclaim. Over the years, she became a familiar face in cinema, taking on characters that showcased her acting skills. Her work includes a variety of roles that demonstrated her range and dedication to her craft. Lindley's career spanned decades, and she remained active in the industry, leaving behind a collection of memorable films. Carol Lindley was a talented actress known for her roles in both movies and television. She started as a child model and then became an actress in her teenage years. One of her most famous roles was in the film The Poseidon Adventure, where she played Nandai Perry. We invite you to share your memories of Carol Lindley. Do you remember the first time you saw her on screen? Maybe it was a movie or a TV show that introduced you to her talent. Or perhaps there's a special scene that stayed with you over the years. We'd love to hear about your favorite moments and experiences related to Carol Lindley. Your stories are important to us and we're eager to read them in the comments below. Stay tuned because we have many interesting facts about her life, including some that are funny, some that are surprising, and some that are touching. Keep watching to learn more about the life and career of Carol Lindley. Carol Lindley, born Carol Ann Jones on February 13, 1942, in New York City, grew up in a world filled with creativity. Her mother, Frances, worked as a waitress and a model introducing Carol to the fashion industry at a young age. Carol's early life was marked by her parents' separation, which led her to seek solace and expression through acting. She started modeling at the age of 15, which opened doors to the acting world. Her first significant role came at the age of 16 in the Broadway play Blue Denim, earning her critical acclaim and setting her on the path to stardom. Her talent was nurtured by directors and fellow actors who saw her potential, guiding her through the early stages of her career. Carol's passion for acting was evident, and her dedication to her craft led her to become a well-known actress in both film and television. Carol Lindley was born on February 13, 1942, in New York City. She grew up in a creative environment. Her father was a writer, and her mother a former dancer. From a young age, she showed interest in the arts and began modeling at 15. Her early work in commercials led to her discovery by a talent scout, which opened the door to acting. Her first significant role was in the Broadway play Blue Denim, which she reprised in the film adaptation, marking the start of her career in Hollywood. This early success set the stage for her lifelong career in acting. Carol Lindley found her love for acting early in life. As a child, she enjoyed playing pretend and imitating characters from her favorite stories. Her defining moment came during a school play. While on stage, the applause and bright lights filled her with joy and excitement. This experience made her realize that acting was her calling. She loved the idea of becoming different people and exploring various lives through her performances. This passion led her to pursue acting as a career where she could share stories and bring joy to others. Carol Lindley took on the role of Assistant District Attorney Mary Fletcher in the movie Vigilante. She was initially cast as Vicki Marino, but the director, William Lustig, made a last-minute decision to switch her role with Rutanya Alda, who was set to play the district attorney. Alda agreed to the change without issue. In The Poseidon Adventure, Lindley portrayed Nan Nai, a character who falls in love with Red Button's character. Despite their on-screen chemistry, Lindley and Buttons did not get along during the shoot and avoided each other unless filming required it. However, this tension turned into a strong friendship over the years, and they were together during Button's last public appearance in 26. Lindley also admires Cameron Diaz, with there's something about Mary being one of her top movie picks. Carol Lindley started her career with financial challenges and faced doubt from the film industry. Despite this, she showed great determination. She took on various roles and worked hard to prove her talent. Her efforts paid off as she became known for her acting skills. She found ways to stand out and earn respect in her field. This shows her strong will to succeed despite tough times. Carol Lindley, after her passing, was honored with her ashes being scattered in the Pacific Ocean. Born to Frances Fuller from Massachusetts and Cyril Roland Jones from Cary, Ireland, she had a diverse heritage. During the filming of The Poseidon Adventure, Lindley faced a unique challenge with her costume. 
The boots she wore, which she owned, began to shrink as they were constantly wet, causing her discomfort throughout the production. Carol Lindley's career had several significant moments. Her role in the film Blue Denim in 1959 was a major turning point. It addressed teenage pregnancy, a topic not commonly discussed at the time, and earned her critical praise. Another highlight was her performance in The Poseidon Adventure in 1972, where she played Nanai Perry. Her portrayal in this disaster film showed her ability to handle roles in intense situations and was a box office success. Her peers and critics noted her strong presence on screen and her skill in bringing depth to her characters. These roles helped establish her as a talented actress in Hollywood. Carol Lindley brought life to the character of Nan Nai in The Poseidon Adventure, a role that showcased her acting skills. This film led to a unique connection with The Love Boat as she and other cast members like Ernest Borgnine and Red Button's later guests starred on the show. In The Cardinal, Lindley portrayed Mona, a role that mirrored her own life at the time, being an Irish-American Catholic woman married to a Jewish man. Her off-screen friendship with Nelson Aspen allowed her to share her insights on showbiz, including her thoughts on the remake of The Poseidon Adventure and her favorite Oscar winners with Frank Sinatra topping her list. Carol Lindley was an actress who brought her unique perspective to each role she played. She approached acting with a natural and intuitive style, often drawing from her own life to inform her performances. Her work reflected her belief in the importance of authenticity and honesty in storytelling. She was known for her ability to connect with her characters on a deep level, bringing a sense of reality to even the most dramatic roles. This connection made her performances stand out and allowed audiences to relate to her characters. Lindley's personal experiences, especially her early start in the industry, shaped her approach to acting and the choices she made in her career. She often chose roles that challenged her and allowed her to grow as an artist. Carol Lindley brought to life a range of characters on the silver screen. In The Last Sunset, she played Missy Breckenridge, where a small mistake shows up Bren O'Malley, played by Kirk Douglas, promises to return by sunset, yet the sun is high when he faces off with Dana Stribling. In The Poseidon Adventure, Lindley's character Nun Nai's singing voice for the song, A Morning After was actually Rene Armand's, not Lindley's own. Lastly, in The Night Stalker, Lindley, known for her role in The Poseidon Adventure, joined forces with Darren McGavin, known for Airport 77, to star in another disaster film, marking their presence in the genre during that era. Carol Lindley was a talented actress known for her roles in films, and television during the 1960s and 1970s. She had a natural ability to bring characters to life, which made her popular among audiences. Her performance in Blue Denim earned her critical acclaim and showed her skill in portraying complex emotions. Lindley also appeared in The Poseidon Adventure, a film that became a classic and influenced disaster movies. Her work inspired other actors to pursue challenging roles and helped shape the way stories are told in cinema. Experts in the field often speak of her clear and expressive acting style, which allowed her to connect with viewers. Those who followed in her footsteps admire her dedication to her craft and her ability to adapt to various roles. Lindley's career is a clear example of how one person's work can influence an entire industry. Carol Lindley took on the role of Assistant D, a Mary Fletcher in the movie Vigilante, a role originally meant for Caroline Munro. Lindley shared a close friendship with Fred Astaire, a talented actor and dancer. Despite rumors of a possible marriage, Astaire married Robin Smith in 1980. Lindley's insights about Astaire are featured in the book Fred Astaire His Friends Talk. From a young age, Lindley was active in modeling and theater, performing in the anniversary waltz at just 12 years old. Her performances in Broadway productions like The Potting Shed and Blue Denim drew significant attention and praise. Carol Lindley was known for her acting career, but she also had a life full of interests and values that shaped her as a person. She cared deeply about children's welfare and supported charities that worked to improve the lives of young ones in need. Her love for animals was evident in her support for animal rights organizations. Lindley believed in giving back to the community and often participated in events to raise awareness and funds for various causes. 
Her personal experiences and beliefs were reflected in the roles she chose and the way she portrayed them, showing her commitment to not just her craft, but also to the things she valued in life. Carol Lindley's appearance on the cover of Life magazine caught the attention of Walt Disney, leading to her first film role in The Light in the Forest. Despite a strong performance alongside James MacArthur, the movie received mixed reviews. Shortly after, she portrayed Melissa Missy Breckenridge in The Last Sunset and Allison McKenzie in Return to Peyton Place. While Dorothy Malone played Constance McKenzie in the later series Peyton Place, Lindley's character was taken over by Mia Farrow. In The Poseidon Adventure, Lindley played Nanai Perry, a character afraid of water, which was ironic considering Lindley herself was a skilled swimmer. Carol Lindley was a talented actress known for her roles in films and television. She worked hard and always tried to improve her skills. She believed in taking every chance to act, no matter how small the role. Her advice for new actors is to never stop learning and to take every opportunity to practice their craft. She also suggested being patient and staying true to oneself. For the future, she hoped to keep acting and maybe direct or teach, sharing her experience with others. She wanted to encourage young actors to be brave and to keep working towards their dreams. Carol Lindley shared her early education with Sandra Dee and Tuesday Weld at a school in New York for young professionals. They were not just classmates, but also appeared together in a magazine for American girls and in a commercial for a popular drink. In her acting career, Lindley played Leslie in Beware, The Blob, and sadly, she, Robert Walker, and Sid Haig all died in the same year, 2019. Lindley's role as Nun Nai in The Poseidon Adventure was memorable, and she added a personal touch by using her own boots and necklace in the movie. Carol Lindley's career in acting showed her strong love for the craft and a drive to bring new ideas to the screen. She worked hard, took risks, and always looked for fresh ways to tell stories. Her roles left a lasting impression on audiences and opened doors for future generations of actors. Her journey reminds us that with creativity and determination, one can leave a lasting stamp on the world. The story of Carol Lindley is a powerful example of how dedication and a love for one's work can lead to great achievements and inspire others to follow their dreams. Carol Lindley, known for her role in the Poseidon Adventure, did not actually sing the song the morning after. The voice heard in the film was that of Rene Armand. Lindley's personal life included her daughter, Jill Selsman, whom she had with her former husband, Michael Selsman. In the movie Return to Peyton Place, Lindley played Allison McKenzie, and an interesting change was made for her co-star Tuesday Weld. To make sure Weld looked different from Lindley and Eleanor Parker, who were playing her family, Weld's blonde hair was dyed darker. This change was made even though the character was previously portrayed by another blonde actress, Hope Lange. Carol Lindley started her career in modeling under the name Carolyn Lee. However, she had to change it to Carol Lindley because another person had already registered that name. In the movie, The Poseidon Adventure, she played Nanai Perry, who only sang for the first 32 minutes and did not speak until she called out for her brother, Teddy. Outside of her acting career, Carol Lindley had a long-term relationship with David Frost that lasted for 18 years. In The Poseidon Adventure, Carol Lindley played Nanai, a young musician. The first scene film for the movie showed Nanai practicing the song the morning after with her band. The original plan was for Wadi Wachtel, who played the guitar, to act as her brother Teddy. However, because Wachtel had brown eyes and Lindley had blue eyes, they chose Stuart Perry, the drummer, to be her brother instead. This change ensured the siblings looked more alike on screen. Carol Lindley, known for her role in the film The Poseidon Adventure, faced a personal tragedy when her daughter's father and her former partner, publicist Michael Selsman, revealed that their daughter Jill had been secretly given up for adoption at birth. This revelation came to light many years later, causing a profound impact on Lindley's life. Despite a successful career, this event was a source of deep sadness for her. Carol Lindley's performances have touched many, and her roles remain memorable. We invite you to share your favorite moments from her career and how they moved you. Your thoughts are valuable as we remember her talent and the joy she brought to the screen. If you enjoy content that honors the artistic spirits who have shaped our viewing experiences, please like, share, and subscribe for more. Your support helps us continue to celebrate and remember the stars who have left a lasting impression on entertainment.
Thank you for joining us in this tribute.